I've been a massive fan of the Dirt franchise since day one. I love this franchise so much, particularly Dirt 3 and Dirt 2. Love those games. And it's going back to those roots. Dirt 5 is here. I'm playing it live right now. Just so you guys are aware, Codemaster sent me a very early code. The game doesn't come out until October, so there might be a few issues here and there, but this is not the final code. Ho hopefully that makes sense. Anyway, let's jump in to the first video and let's check out America. Oh, wow. Look at that wing. I've gone to the extreme levels straight away. Look at that horsepower. 900 horsepower. All going to the rear wheels. Yes. Performance. S. Handling. C. Oh. <laughs> this could be fun. I've never driven this vehicle ever yet. I went briefly and just tried the game out very, very quickly with the Ford Escort. That's all I've done. I've never driven this vehicle. Oh. It's an oval track. Interesting. How many laps? This is going to be um, interesting. Uh, yeah, I have turned the music off as well. Whoa. Look at that wing. Oh, this is insane. This is absolutely insane. I can barely put the power down. Where's the wheels? Yeah, this is the... Yeah, music is pretty blaring out right now, but it's just not worth it in terms of getting a copyright strike or something. So I've turned the music off completely. Oh, wow. These things are absolute monsters. And I'm, for some reason, I started off pretty well. And I'm now in seven. <laughs> I just cannot control the power. This is mad. I'm almost in last place. This is embarrassing. What's the best route? Looks like going on the outside is probably the best way to go around it. This is mad. Oh, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, this is the dirt I love. Literally, it's dirt everywhere. I can't wait to play it on the Xbox Series X and the PS5 as well. It's going to be insane. Very impressed with the graphics already. PC. Eighth place. Slight FPS hitch there. The last lap. I've not done very well. <laughs> These vehicles are insane. Oh, damn. I got... Owned. Absolutely owned. That was a quick event as well. Yep. I'll have to come back to that. Yeah, that was my that was my first go, as you clearly tell. That was mad. Uh let's go to Brazil. I like the sound of that. Look at some of these vehicles. Hmm. There's a good selection already. I might ooh, depends what I want really. The Aerial Nomad Tactical has good horsepower, slightly more weight, maybe the Aerial Nomad. If there's a certain vehicle you want to see, by the way, in the future videos, let me know. So yeah, you got different classes in certain events. Let's go for the Aerial Nomad. That's, that's a good choice. I have struggled in previous games with the Aerial Nomad. It's just there's not much weight, and there's a lot of power going to that rear wheel. And it, it just, it's hard to handle, very tricky to handle. Look at those bugs, Jesus. Yeah, the game looks really good, actually. Really nice. Excuse me. Yeah, I'm struggling for the power again. <laughs> I've got it on low assists. Maybe I need more assists. I don't know. Whoa, when I get going, though. No. I fly. Ouch. Mud looks great. Three laps. Got it. If I can try and get into the top three, I would be uh, happy with that. Just try and get that power down. It feels like a dirt game though, it feels good. I really... I wasn't sure about dirt 4. I don't know, some of the changes they made... I don't... I just don't think I really... Yeah. I don't know. I'm not sure it's for me. I missed the... Uh, I missed dirt 3, I missed, I missed dirt 2. This is definitely going back to those roots. And man, does this game look gorgeous. It looks mighty fine. Stunning. What is that in the background? <laughs> looks a bit... Yeah. <laughs> like a penis. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. I'm being childish. It's a 
I've got this. I've got this fairly under control right now. I'm doing good. Thanks to that first event. Managing to control the power. Get it around fairly well. Power! Oh, I love these vehicles. It's so crazy. I be mad to drive at these speeds. Oh, I forgot. Cockpit view. Actually pretty good as well. Look at that. Mud absolutely everywhere. Cockpit looks great. The lead as well. Damn, this game is great. One of the games actually I would like to try with a wheel. I think a few wheels work for this build. Obviously there'll be more uh, wheels on release. I always feel like I go slower pop it view because it's more terrifying. So much mud. Yeah, they're going to so many different locations. There seems to be so many vehicles as well in the build and the full release. I just can't wait for this game to be honest. And the career mode has Nolan Wolf and Troy Baker. Yes, Joel himself in the game and Nathan Drake. Madness. Because I'm, I'm, a, I'm a career guy. That, that's, 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 that's why I play most. We are absolutely dominating this event so far. Whoa! I keep flying off that jump straight towards that rock. What I like about this game as well, it's bright, it's colourful, vibrant. It's not dark and dingy. I'm sure there is dark and dingy. Maybe in a, if you do night time. So pretty, it's so bright. To the point where my eyes almost hurt. Confetti! Reminds me of Fools, actually. <laughs> they love confetti in that game. It's like puddles. You definitely feel it with the controller. And the grip seems to like, disappear when you touch those little puddles of water. The terrain is constantly changing. Obviously, it's not um, a simulation as such, like. Dirt Rally, of course. It's a very different game. It's definitely more arcadey. If you want a more sim experience, uh, Dirt Rally is still there, of course. That, that's the game for you. I think we have one last corner. And that is it. We are done. For me to Completed it, mate. Yes. Nicely done. Was that a good time? I don't know. Definitely one of those builds as well when I keep coming back, trying to improve my time, try out all the different vehicles. I can only show you a certain amount of gameplay and do a certain amount of videos, so to be a little bit careful on that front. Right, so we're going to Norway and we're checking out the 90s rally the vehicles, the retros. The Impreza, the Evo 6, the Escort RS Cosworth. So they're all BNAs. What has the most horsepower? Hmm, I'm not sure what to go with. I think it's got to be, it's got to be the Impreza. Such a classic. I love it. Off to Norway we go. I love the, the art style as well. It looks really cool. It feels like a dirt game. Which I love. There's a New York track on the ice. That's going to be mad. Not the demo, but it's in the game. But I want to win this. Yes, I believe there is dynam dynamic weather, dynamic uh, weather conditions as well in the game. Like, I'm pretty sure I played this the first time and it was bright. Wonderfully bright. Now, let's see, I think, it's, I think the sun's setting now, I believe. Look at that. It's a bit foggy and hazy. Ooh, ouchie. Special cuts. Oh, no. <laughs> they just got a little bit lost. On, step it up. No time like the present, thank you. Oh, that is a cool looking interior. So many racing games now just avoid, avoid the interior. It just takes so much time. And I believe it's maybe 5 or 10% of players actually use it. So there's not many. I need to speed up. I was actually very close to getting a Cobra exhaust for my 350. I've seen sponsor. I was very close. I got 
close, but I never actually changed it in the end. It's all stuck still. The Cobra exhaust for the 350 sounded really nice. That was what was tempting me. I cannot see we finish in a great position here. Not really made any mistakes, but clearly not quick enough. Come on. Speed up, Scully. I've never really seen a weather condition like this. Hazy, sunsetty. Get a bit darker again. Again, okay, that dynamic changing conditions. Coming through. Oh, I'm taking that position, my friend. Stop fighting. I can't actually select the AI, so I don't know what our high actually is. Um, you can take off certain assists. That's it. It's getting really dark now. Yeah, this is cool. That is terrifying. I cannot see where I'm going right now. Damn, this is cool. Why is the mouse keep appearing? I'm so sorry. I'm not doing that. Ugh, there we go. <laughs> I am slow. I'm so well in that last event with that aerial nomad. Whoa! I'm gonna have to redo this at some point. That lightning. That was. This is crazy conditions. Terrifying. I cannot see in front of me right now. What the hell? What is going on? I've never seen weather like this. I'm really excited for this game now. I know it's a little bit, almost a bit much, but it's so cool. I like the challenge of it as well. I literally, the lightning is lighting my path. It's crazy. in last place right now super embarrassing I can't see where I'm going I can't lift I just can't do it the last lap oh that lightning I just saw that yeah that is um, last place <laughs> very mixed in terms of races I've done there I don't know if that's a good time or not. I feel like I was doing all right. I guess I was just being a bit, bit, bit of a, bit, a bit of a scaredy cat with the acceleration. Maybe I don't know. Bit of a bit of a wimp. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the first video on Dirt Five. Should I do more? Should I play more of the demo? Should we come back to this event? Try and redo it. That was good fun. What an incredible looking game. It's going back to those classic, classic routes which I miss so much. So I'm very, very excited. See you guys soon, and bye, bye.